Welcome back everybody, I am Ray Frazier and today we are going to talk about coming soons. So NAR's clear cooperation policy is in place to ensure a fair and cooperative marketplace for agents and for consumers. The coming soon policy was put in place to limit the opportunity for off-market or pocket listings that aren't available to the public. Once you have a listing agreement signed, if it's not going active in the MLS within 24 hours, you have the option to put the listing in the MLS as a coming soon. But here's why that's important. If the property is not in the MLS as a coming soon, you cannot market the property in any way outside of your individual brokerage. Obviously that limits the opportunity to generate more business for your listing and to leverage it in a number of ways. But if the property is in the MLS, has it coming soon, you have 21 days to market the property on social media, utilizing digital marketing, print marketing, door knocking, online, etc. Now the goal for that is to leverage that listing to generate more business in the way of buyers and other people thinking about selling their property. It's important to note at day 22, SDMLS is automatically going to move your listing to active if you haven't done so already. You can't actually show the property while it's listed as a coming soon. So once you start showing the property, you have to change it to active and open it up to anyone to show. And the reason for this is to create a fair and cooperative environment that doesn't limit access to properties for agents or for consumers. Coming soons are published on all IDX websites like your Zillow, your Redfin, and your Realtor.com. It's a big deal for a lot of teams and individual agents because in a way it can handcuff your ability to market the listing exclusively and demonstrate elevated value to your client. Now for better or worse, this does level the playing field for all agents and ultimately is going to force us to get a little creative with how we market the properties and continue to drive traffic and value to our clients and our business. Now, if you're watching this video and you have a listing that you've taken with a seller, I encourage you to look at creative ways to market that listing and build up some interest in that 21 day period that's gonna help your seller get more offers and ultimately elevate the price of their property. I hope you found some of the information in today's video valuable. If you liked what you heard, click below to subscribe and check us out next week for some more real estate news.